Hello, internet friends. My name is Still Bay. This is still my forehead, and this is still 31 episodes in Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. But I'm bad. A light commentary playthrough series where I play through this whole game and not talk a lot because this game has lots of cutscenes. Right now, I'm going to deal with my nose itching because allergies are a thing. This is the location for the next reactor stone. We don't even know where the next reactor is. Hmm. Well, we know it's here. Is that the zone I think it is? Huh. I think it is Gungaga. It's a big jungle, right? here. There must be a path this way to go this way down because where main quest goes. The other reactor. The other two proto relics aren't here right now. All right, let's go uh, get messed up by the Tonberry King, no doubt. I do have an item to put on someone that they don't get one shot. Who best to anchor the squad? I mean, Aerith, right? But she's not the one that can use items super easy. All right, Cloud only has his provisional. It's gonna be a cutscene spawn, most likely. Put the anti one shot on Tifa. I could do Yuffie or Tifa, probably Tifa if it's a single target boss. I could run them both.
the cuts when we walk down, I imagine. Oh, it's a summon. That's right. Summon. Cloud, it appears that you've arrived at the lair of the Tonberry King. That crown belongs on a far statelier head than his, namely yours. I'd say it's high time we divest him of it. That HP super matters against a Tonberry, but oops. Slow. You have to steal the crown specifically. The special attack, however, is unrevive. It can be morphed into the king's robes. You can farm these, but holy crap. Okay. Snatch the crown? No, no. How do I grab it? Oh. A goal. The fact that he's morphable though is crazy. 
No, I don't have a revive yet. No revive materia. I have to use uh, Phoenix Downs and stuff. <laughs> We're all at one HP. <laughs> I kind of want to do that again, though. And, um... Because it gets easier to farm because you get items that resist insta-death. He's morphable into the item, which is nuts. <laughs> Additionally. Vitality and Spirit, which is physical defense, magic defense. Immune to slow and instant death, which is, seems just nuts. And you could farm this guy a couple times and make three of them, for example. I think if, if it's a, every time you clear, kind of like the Quetzalcoatl bangs and stuff. So, I'll do this. Having the safety bit there definitely helped. And that was from an optional thing we did earlier. Does she have one? She just had punchy gloves before, right? Punchy gloves. I can't make these stronger ones yet. So I'm going to run Yuffie to try to morph. My God. It's so much defense. It's crazy. Try again. Well, I could do that and then... Just to make it a little easier. I remember I put the assess earring back on though. At least this fight will be interesting. 
Like, it even hit my teammates that aren't even in the party. And there's only an AoE around him. a marred crown. It's a key item. I don't think I got it. But he has nothing stealable then. Only morphable. Okay. The steal is for the... No, he's I mean, a proportional. Sometimes you get stunned by those. Like, I don't know which, what causes it. It does actually just damage this damage. Heal up while you can. Okay. Is he low enough? Almost? Just another. I'm gonna check my. Oops. You hit the wrong button. Why am I pausing here? Oh, because I have the engage enemy thing up. Do so I have to walk here? Yeah. It might just be a collectible. I don't think I got it though. I got a pristine crown, but not the marred crown. Okay. 
Well, I'm going to try to get the marred crown. Live edit. Huh. Oh. Just got it. Took a few more clears. Hmm. Is it meant to just be that it's not the one you need because it's just a drop instead of the one you get for doing the mechanic? But it's a key item, though. So do we do anything with it? Could you give this to Johnny instead of a pristine crown? That'd be rude. I have no idea. That's super interesting, though. But I have multiple karmic cows, so it became very easy to uh, farm. And quite easy. Where did those gloves go? Even though Karma Cowl on Aerith might also just be like good all the time. It's just so tanky. But now what did she have? She had on the do we have circlet too? She was wearing the uh this the psychic charm, so she can't be silenced. Which we got from the mind flare. Alright, let's go back to Johnny. Hello, Johnny something. You took down the Tonberry King for us? Like four or five Thanks, times. bro. On behalf of all Johnnies. So, where's the crown? Hold on to it for now. That's how I think she'll get the crown. Oh, you can. gonna be mean to Johnny. I wonder what that does though. That's that's for a new game plus. Give him the marred one. We have to do that later because I want to give him the pristine one. Whoa! Get a load of the shine on that baby. <laughs> it is positively legendary. And we went through positively legendary trouble to get it for you. Don't worry. The fruits of your labor are going to be on full display. Man, I can't wait to see the look on my face when I see this. I'm going to take this baby back to the hotel. Be sure to swing by when you have the chance. I'm sure one of me will have something real nice waiting for you. The only question is, will it be easy or to do the marred crown because it requires it to drop versus doing it on hard mode and refarming. But I should have my all my items. So if I have all my items, then just put the karma cowls on. Unless those reset in hard mode. The best way to make tracks is on Choco Bag. Choco Bag right here, boy. Where are you headed, bro? And we made it! Thank you for using Johnny's fast travel service. <laughs> the smell alone's got my mouth watering. I think it's getting hotter. Careful, Johnny, careful. Sorta. Good news, bro! All of me made it back in one piece. 
And it sounds like I really put you through the ringer. Sorry about that. <laughs> no biggie. So what now? Want me to poop him? What? No, not yet. Mm. We're in the middle of renovating, and I'm gonna need all my hands on deck to finish. At the end of the day, I want to be able to say I remodeled this place all by myself. Right, Johnny's? Yeah, bro. <laughs> so yeah, me and me's are set on seeing this through the end. But once we're finished, it's gonna be the finest hotel in the whole world. Just you wait. Oh, this is where all our stuff goes. Yep. Our collectible junk. So, what do you think, bro? I'm impressed. Without you guys, none of this would have been possible. You are absolutely right. You couldn't have done any of this without my incredible ninjutsu. Couldn't have done it without the J Squad either. I don't go getting all sentimental. We were just doing what you would have done. You said it. We, we all want what's, what's best, best for this place. place. It's, it's our home. And, and none, none of us would be standing here today if it weren't for you, you. Johnny, Johnny Prime. Prime. Truly, you are the realest bro, bro. <laughs> well, I'm just happy to know that whatever trials await, we'll face them together. Uh, yeah, about that. Now that all the renovations are complete, I think it's time that we peace out. What? Don't worry. You got this, Johnny. Johnny? You don't need us anymore, Johnny. You've got you. Johnny. <laughs> Johnny, Johnny us! Johnny's! You know, I couldn't stand listening to them bicker. And now. I already miss the sound of our melodious voice. Aww. I lost a part of myself today. <laughs> you gonna let that stop you? Huh? You've got a hotel to run. That's true. I remodeled this place with my own 14 hands. I owe it to me and myself to see that our hard work doesn't go to waste. Oh yeah! I'm gonna be seven Johnnies in one! I think one of you is more than enough. Hmm. Oh, that means a lot coming from you, bro. Oh, almost forgot. I set up a little space to show off your collection. The J Squad. I'd love to showcase any rare or interesting artifacts you happen to come across. And rest assured, you'll be handsomely rewarded for them. Oh, gosh. I've got my heart set on becoming the best in the business. So look out, hotel industry. We'll attract guests from far and wide with luxurious lodgings and unbeatable hospitality. But you'll always have a room with your name on it, my bro. Cause when you're here, you're Johnny. What? <laughs> yep, collector's items. <laughs> Automatically donate them to your best bro. Press L2 to view your current treasure trove, as well as hints on to find more collector's items. Oh! Thirty-three of eighty-eight. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm imagine a lot are tied to the story. Since they're saying information about this treasure is currently unavailable, so it can't be a spoiler.
Complete the ghost ship stage of Pirate's Rampage in Costa del Sol. Oh no, there's new minigame stages. Oh god. Complete the time trial at Run Wild. Yep. Complete the crunch off. Oh no. Love the little anime Johnny stickers. Basically. Win all the grade three races. Did all easy rank cards challenges the gold saucer. Lead all rank two person bouts the gold saucers must of the Coliseum. Yeah, there are six person T what's the UI for that gonna be? Six person teams. Do you control everyone or just three and the other three are auto? Win the Beast Battleground Prison Tournament in the Dust Bowl. Yep. It was like level 40 something, so we're not going to do that crap right now. Even the Coliseum stuff was like high 30s. Find and excavate a particular rabbit burrow with a chocobo in the grasslands. In Gungaga. Knife is for stabbing, people for cursing, but not you. You are friend, my one and only friend, right? Yeah, you know, they're in areas we haven't been to yet, even though it does mention Gungaga. Ooh. Or they're just they're tied to story progression. Okay, wow. That's red. That's gonna be a summon material. How's the collectathon coming, bro? Oh. We need to finish the whole collection. Because red is summon material. Purple is weapons. All this stuff's just sitting out here exposed to the elements, though, which is a little weird. The pieces are acquired tastes, but interesting. Yeah. Whoa! This is technically this is Barrett's room. Oh, these are the. These are from Remake. These are not from Rebirth. These are the Remake weapons. Those are all Barrett's from Remake. Oh. Those are Cloud Swords from Remake. I didn't realize that at first. It was too fast. Oh, that's freaking cool. And whose are these? staffs from the remake oh that's annoying i don't have yuffie's third option from intermission because you needed to have that as a like pre-order bonus years ago it's a uh, the cactuar one or the cactwang or whatever the hell it's called it's a shirk in the shape of a giant cactuar i don't have that one because i don't have that i didn't have that as a bonus that's cool they include it for those that do Oh, yeah. That's a neat little nod to the, the remake right there. That's cool. Hmm. 
<laughs> I heard they got some unusual pieces here. Well, that's a lot. Now, do we still have to squeeze through to leave? It's changed so much. I almost didn't recognize it. I don't have new dialogue, do you guys have? never stayed there. The owner. Oh. I guess I didn't take that picture. Hey there. Thank you for tracking down that spot. Quite the view you captured. Very nice. I'd say you're a first-rate photographer now. If the association had any lingering doubts about you, this latest shot should have completely dispelled them. At this rate, you'll outrank me. But hey, friendly competition never hurt anyone. Seasoned photographer. Okay. Oh, no. Now it's no squish hey, to get there. How about an orb or two? Since we're here. I don't know what the other minigame is, or, uh, quest is here, though. <laughs> you do your infantry infant. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> no. You do have to, like, wait for them to get changed, which is both neat and a little bit fine. All right, Cloud, I know your sword is on your back because of magic, but like, let's be real. Weapons will not be displayed while wearing this outfit. What about clouds? <laughs> he only has the naval crew? Our man needs more outfits. Now, how is it staying on its back? Monster Burger with Beef Scott Bunny. You ready for a swashbuckling good time? Maybe it's not available yet. Hope our game hooked ya. There's supposed to be another level here. I guess not yet. Schmoovin. Have you been to Bardell Soul? Looks oh, great. into it with that Shinra scientist. Oh, wow, it is you. I'm Fran. And I'm Naomi. Name's Yorda. And we would like to hire you for a job. Interested? That depends. It's simple. Girl and boy go on a date. Easy peasy, right? Mm -hmm. A date? The three of us are designers for Costa del Sol's premier fashion boutique. For our next line, we're thinking something sexy, perfect for the beach, the bar, or in the boudoir. Mm. But creatively speaking, it's been a struggle. We've been racking our brains forever. And the showcase is basically now. It's do or die, and we don't want to kill our careers. So, that's where you come in. We want to see a real couple on a date, for inspiration. 
Well, sound like a good gig? Hojo, as in that Shinra guy? We were just doing the mayor a favor, that's all. And if we're being honest, we figured it couldn't hurt to butter up a company bigwig. We got a business to run. Because we can tell you like your women assertive. And since we're all about strong, confident ladies, we thought, ka-ching! One look at you and we knew that woman's not afraid to take what she wants. Maybe? I mean, uh, I'd like to think so. <laughs> So is, this, is it always an Aerith side quest? Or is it because of the outfit I put her in? But we're all in the same? When you can't back out. Hojo, as in that Shinra? Once you're in the screen, you can't do anything about it. You can't leave it. We knew you would. And so... We've already planned the perfect date for lovebirds like you. Get rowdy at Run Wild. Be ready to swashbuckle at Pirate's Rampage. Oh. This is going to be your best date yet. We'll make sure of it. Maybe it's just always an Aerith side quest. Because all side quests are essentially... Uh, locked to a person this is one of the stranger jobs you've accepted still a job i'll take the lead hey i can help i'll make this date our best yet we could just keep it simple and what's a simple date in your world like a walk across rooftops perhaps sure <clears throat> ah, memories because what's weird about that is that Aerith's lower status than Tifa. So it's got to be just that it's her. Just like a cloud Aerith quest. I don't know if, I, if it bugged out that his sword's still on his back. <laughs> Look who it is. So... Are you ready to aim and fire? Do well, and you might just land a bullseye on her heart. Oh, gosh. ship. So over 18k. Go, go! Wow! Nice one! So awkwardly sensitive. Great job. Nice one. Yeah, but you actually don't want to miss. Nice one. 
Boom. No way. Holy crap. Go, go. Great job. Nice one. You did. Oh, there's two. really fast okay so you, you don't want to spam fire unless you need to nice one guess we'll try again it's almost there so you got this Turn around. Nice one. Oh, it starts all the way over there. Oh! I saw you. Unfortunately, too late. Ready for that time. My finger's starting to hurt. She kind of <laughs> finger is cramping up. Wow, look at that score. Those are some pro numbers. But what did the lady think? Oh, got me right through the heart, the cat. <laughs> you know. The secret is to aim for the head, not the heart. She never once took her eyes off her man. And the way she stared at him, the score didn't matter. <laughs> Thanks, cuties. That was just what I needed. I'll head back now that the creative juices are flowing again. You two, however, still have a date to finish. Go find Naomi at Run Wild. Now, how's that bangle, though? Oops. It's an abyssal bangle. What are we talking here? Only three. Oh, it's high uh, physical. I sleep.
I wonder what the girls have next on the agenda for us. Here we have one of our more cheap date ideas. Oh, lighten up. We're trying to enjoy ourselves. Trying to get paid. You're no fun at all today. Well, for the record, I am treating this as a date. I wish you wouldn't. Why? Because I'm no romantic. Believe me, I know. Right. <laughs> Absolutely owned. Got a real good selection today. Coffee and tacos, and that's made in heaven. Find anything sweet and enticing. Step right up. We've got the best selection in Costa Del. Welcome to Run Wild, a paradise. Someone took their sweet time, I see. Better hurry, or the game will start without you. What game? Run wild, of course. Tell me you've heard of it. It's only the hottest sport in town. Not hard to guess why, seeing all those cutie wooties. I mean, it's the perfect spot for a date. Are you ready to go? Okay, now time trial. Survival of the fastest. It's a new twist on Run Wild. Shoot all the numbered balls into their corresponding goals in the shortest amount of time to win. Color coded. Under three minutes. All right. Wish me luck, okay? You do know this is for animals, right? Not people. People are technically animals, too. Right? So it's cool. Wrong! Not cool. <laughs> what? I really can't compete? No, but your pet can. But though I take umbrage with that nomenclature, I'm happy to offer my assistance. Red's got this. <sighs> well, I guess we'll just have to be the cheer squad. Give me an R, give me an E, give me a D! Is that not? Huh? Is it not just once each? Oh, we have to do them in order, not just match. I see. Maybe I missed that. I thought it was just colors in correct goals, fast as possible. Trick shots. Uh, yellow. Blue. Uh, 
Oh, wow. That's confusing. There it is. Nice. Well under. You are like a red bolt shooting across that field. <laughs> I am quick on my feet. The three of us should go around sometime. Wouldn't that be fun? Yes. <laughs> if you enjoy losing. <laughs> Their dog is Cat. the glue that binds their relationship. And watching their little guy give it his all out there only served to strengthen their bond. That's it! I'm such a genius! I've got to get this idea down on paper! I need to get back to the shop, like, yesterday! Okay. Yord is at the stables for the final part of your date. So what are you waiting for? Get those tushies on a chocobo! Mm-hmm. Barking's fine, but no biting. Uh, wonder what sort of design the girls are going to come up with. Hey, what kind of swimsuit would you want to see? Me? Yes, you. I'm curious. Where's the well, best place for I prefer functional reform. So, durable, may be made with non-absorbent materials that allow for full range of motion. In case you need to fight underwater. <laughs> Okie dokie then. <clears throat> Was it a terror? Wait, where are they? Oh, they're actually out the front gate. Or maybe we'll try. I guess they didn't say to go ride a chocobo. Technically, skimpier would be better for function. It's true. You know, all those memes about, you know, medieval armor that women wear compared to like what men wear. Men are like dark souls, heavy armor, plate, you know, helmet, big shield, big weapon. Blah, blah, blah. And women are like metal bikini, G-string, buckler, tiny sword or some crap. They're, I mean, more agile normally than, I guess, the male fantasy cares, but you're, you're not wrong. I think it's just because whatever looks cool in the character is cool in the character. There you are. Okay, I've got a great activity for you. So the idea is to ride Kaima <laughs> here and enjoy a romantic stroll along the beach. Oh. <laughs> but that on its own sounds like a huge yawn fest. So try hunting for shells while you're at it. How about you bring me the largest one you can find? Sound good? I'll be chilling back here. So you two run along and have yourselves one shell of a time. Don't. What are you still doing here? Get down to the beach and see what kind of shells you can find. Don't forget to have fun, okay? Also, it's just sexy. What? I don't know about you, but this is definitely a first for me. You've ridden them before. I'm not talking about the chocobos. Oh, you meant the shells, right? Right. <sighs> Wait a second. Are you nervous? About what? Easiest job I've ever had. The Merc's nervous. <laughs> Those are shells. We should be able to find some good shells around here. But first, we clean up the trash.
Well, I'm probably just gonna get wasted on potions real quick. He's drinking his uh, confidence juice. My turn. Best do it right. Uh, fire attacks break the stains. Let me handle this. Right. Frog. I'll show you what I can do. Get him. Uh, that'll do. Come on. Beautiful. Hey, cool. <laughs> All right, seashells. Ready or not, here we come. Let's saddle up first. Then search. Sounds good. Back on the birds we go. Gathering seashells. <laughs> kind of weird having Tifa third wheel your shell hunting date. Hey. It's not a third wheel. It's just a harem at this point. Cat and wolf included. who live in them would make for good eating. Wonder how they taste. <laughs> we could ask a local, but you don't strike me as the type to carol. It's so teeny tiny. You know, a lot of troopers take half a shell with them when they head out on missions. I know where this is going. It's meant to be a keepsake for their partner, right? A symbol of their undying love. And an omen of death for the trooper if anyone else sees either one, some people say. Oh. Hmm. That took a turn. Hmm. It's a small area. Do it. All set. Gotcha. You watch it? 
Had to go up. Apparently not. The, the border of this is right next to this one, which is a little bit annoying. to me what about you cloud are you sure this is the part where you're supposed to blurt out i don't want to go back i want to stay here with you this date's doa otherwise okay now you're just being mean i'm not trying to be mean i sorry it's fair Now, because you can leave and not... Now, I wonder if that actually has implications. What if you do poorly on the minigames, like you don't get the max score? And what if you do leave this play date? What, what happens? I mean, it's just, would it be negative relationship? Would it be nothing? You wouldn't gain anything then? Huh? How much? You know, D and D RPG is in this. Welcome back, you two. So, happen to find any neat shells out there? How is the beach? Romantic? <laughs> which shell do? You, I mean, which shell do you hand over? Obviously, we do the three-star one, right? Whoa. Huge, right? Dang. That thing belongs in a museum or something. I can't help but wonder what is making her smile from ear to ear like that. Is it the shells? Or... Ha! I've got it! Inspiration has finally struck. I know what to make. But before I go, swing by the fashion showcase. We want you front row center. See you there. Hey. Next time we need a chocobo, I say we ride double. And slow down the bird? Which would make it that much easier to take in all the scenery. I'm still steering. <laughs> oh, fine. If you've got to be the man up front, one thing I was wondering about this is, is this a Aerith date? Is it Cuba the first time we got our swimsuits and I had Aerith and Cloud matching so I didn't understand the system? Because there's a style. These are all matching styles and then the other ones that are like more clothed or more in involved are a matching style. So. Oh, Shinny. Try Johnny's Seaside Travel Service. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Thanks to you, Johnny and I got a little closer and... Well, one thing led to another. But I'm having such a blast working that there isn't time for anything else. Maybe when things calm down. Oh. Hi, where are you heading today? That's adorable. With that, my work 
work is done. Enjoy your stay and don't be a stranger. Bye, Jenny. Soup physique. You want to get ripped? You want a hot fog? Then you better train with the best of the best. Oh no. So come, come join, join our, our gym, gym and muscle, muscle maximize. maximize. It's time for setups. I'm so glad you came. So, what did you think of the show? You were the inspo after all. I absolutely loved it, but the two of us didn't do anything inspo worthy. We just had fun. That's what we wanted. Happy couples get us inspired and fired up. Hmm. Exactly. This place is more than just a vacay spot. It's a paradise where people come to create lifelong memories <laughs> and making sure they do <laughs> is what we do best. So next time you swing by, promise to frolic in the waters, bask in the sun, Enjoy our town to its fullest and leave with a smile. <laughs> Do my eyes deceive me? Is that cloud? Hello, Jules. Oh, hey, you trade the city for the beach, too? What are you doing here? Relaxing, really. We're on our yearly beach retreat and commissioning this year's new singlets from these talented young women. <laughs> oh, right. That reminds me. Stop by the training facility when you have a moment. We're in need of your particular skills. Okay. Updated mini games. But new prizes and even higher scores in these revamped games. Revamped games. Goodness. Three rounds of these. Good God. That stuff was cute, but well, now they're tied. They're both the uh, four tier blue happy face. I just hope we can make enough to meet the demand. I wonder if there's a market for doggy swimsuits. <laughs> I'm expecting lots of lovebirds next season. I'll see you at the training facility. Well, we're here. Might as well minigame. Have you been to Bardell Soul? It's great. This be Pirate's Rampage. Indeed. Oh, now Ghost Ship. Ooh, 22,000. Didn't I have 23k with my accuracy bonus and then I flubbed it? Wind Materia Earrings. All right.
Oh, that's tough. There's a cactuar on that side. Come on. Nah. I think I need those cactuar to get that those points though. It's pretty good. Warm up. Oops. flip. The ghost on the boat are a bait on that round, on round two. I think I need to go faster on that. Maybe you get waiting for gold is not as good. I did it. Damn. Could have got even more. It does start to get like a finger cramp though. <laughs> there we go. See you next time, matey. Platinum earring. Oh, I did that in under two minutes in the first place. Such as a dude again. But stay under two minutes. Well, it's 2.30. Platinum earring, though. Red first. Blue.
I'm dumb. Resetting it, I guess. Reflection. We have a yellow next. Are you serious? You both get in there. Oops. Get. <laughs> That's stuck. A little slower, but still fine. That one derp. Come back soon. Double checking. Yeah, we made a pair later, but it's just a ten percent of magic. So many accessories in this game. It's just like overwhelming compared to a remake. So hold on. Step there were, right up, we lose. There were two. Weren't there two prizes or two collectibles for doing those? Yeah, my 35 now. Now, it's hard to tell which one. I got because this is a I kind of wish that the you could scroll the list and you could see if it shows you like where's the new ones there's no way to know which 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 is the new ones I go to my here in here hmm I don't know which ones it were that we just got but we got two more the they're somewhere could prove interesting subject matter. it was hard to tell Gosh, there's a dolphin. I'm sure it's gonna be going back and doing the dolphin minigame. They've got some amazing stuff. That's gonna be tough. The dolphin riding racing trick thing. I heard they got some unusual. Oh, we're still flagged as a hmm. Side quest just popped up. Here? It's changed so much. I almost didn't recognize it. Rustic charm notwithstanding. Johnny's always so old. Hey, how about an orb or two? Well, there's another orchestral role to play. You want it? We've got it. Come and see for yourself. Welcome to Run Wild. 
an exclamation point on it. Oh, it's just to go to the to the gym. Well, I think that's a good chunk for this one. Thank you for watching if you have been live or if you've been watching on YouTube. Thank you as well. I don't know how well the sit-ups are going to go. I'm going to go try to do some more Kestrin roll stuff. As I said before in a previous episode, now I'm no longer recording those because they get copyright flagged like that. The uh, piano music. Just because of the background orchestron, once it builds up, if I'm doing well enough, it's just the song playing. And I just don't want to have to keep claiming and wait 30 days for it to drop it. So, yeah. But I'll see you all in the next one. Incoming pain.